The SPDRS and P Regional Banking ETF CRE, is an exchange-traded fund ETF, that tracks the performance of the S&P Regional Bank's Select Industry Index. The index is made up of stocks of companies that are classified as regional banks according to the Global Industry Classification Standard GICS. The fund was first launched in 2006 and is managed by State Street Global Advisors. One of the main advantages of investing in CRE is diversification. The fund holds stocks of over 80 regional bank companies, which helps to spread out risk and potentially reduce volatility compared to investing in a single company. Additionally, regional banks tend to have a more focused business model compared to larger, more diversified banks, which can make them less vulnerable to economic downturns. Another potential benefit of investing in CRE is the potential for income. Regional banks often pay dividends, and the fund has a current yield of approximately 2.2%. It's important to note, however, that dividend yields can fluctuate and there is no guarantee that the fund will continue to pay dividends in the future. Risks to consider when investing in CRE include the possibility of a decline in the overall performance of the regional banking sector and the impact of rising interest rates on the profitability of banks. Additionally, the fund has a higher expense ratio compared to some other ETFs, which can eat into returns. In terms of performance, CRE has generally performed in line with the overall stock market. Over the past five years, the fund has returned an annualized 8.5%, compared to a return of 9.1% for the S&P 500 index. In summary, the SPDR S&P Regional Banking ETF CRE, offers investors the opportunity to gain exposure to the regional banking sector through a diversified portfolio of stocks. While there are risks to consider, the fund has the potential for income and has generally performed in line with the overall stock market over the long term. As with any investment, it's important to carefully consider your financial goals and risk tolerance before deciding if CRE is right for you.